Hi everyone, this is Jan Angeles, and today I'm going to discuss to you all about noun, the singular and plural noun, and how to use this in a sentence. Today's topic is all about noun. When we talk about noun, it is a word that names a person, animal, place, thing, event, or idea. Example here, we have person, names of persons. We have John, Reynald, Christian, student, doctor, president. Names of animals, we have cat, pig, dog, lion, bird, tiger. Place, we have SM, church, hospital, Philippines, playground, dining room. Names of things, we have plate, book, ruler, glass, cell phone, face mask. Events, birthday, new year, anniversary, church day, wedding day, graduation day. Idea, we have joy, plan, hope, talent, thought, freedom. Noun also can refer to one or more than one person, animal, place, thing, event, or idea. A noun that names one person, animal, place, thing, event, or idea, we call this a singular noun. Examples, boy, cat, pencil, room. A noun that names more than one person, animal, place, thing, event, or idea, we call this plural noun. Examples, we have boys, cats, pencils, rooms. And also, there are rules with regards to singular and plural noun. First, add es to nouns that end in ch, sh, o, ss, x, and z to get their plural forms. For example, ostrich, ostriches. Dish, dishes, mango, mangoes, bus, buses, princess, princesses, fox, foxes, quiz, quizzes. More examples, table, tables, church, churches, box, boxes, tomato, tomatoes. Some words ending in O take only S in its plural form. Piano, pianos. The nouns that end in a consonant followed by Y change into plural form by changing the Y to I and then adding ES. Examples, baby, babies, city, cities, country, countries. More examples, lady, Ladies, fly, flies, study, studies, cherry, cherries, story, stories. The nouns that ends in a vowel followed by Y change into plural form simply by adding S. Toy, toys, monkey, monkeys. More examples, key, kiss, boy, boys. To form the plural of a noun that ends in F or FE, we replace the F or FE with VES. For example, leaf, leaves, loaf, loaves. More examples, elf, elves, self, selves, life, lives, wife, wives, knife, knives. A few noun that ends in F or FE, we just replace the F or FE with S. Example, ref, refs, surf, surfs, belief, beliefs, safe, safes, giraffe, giraffes. Nouns that have the same form in singular and plural are irregular noun. For example, sheep, sheep. Hair, hair, deer, deer. 
A few singular nouns form their plural by changing the inside vowel or vowels. We have man, men, tooth, teeth, foot, feet. So, how to use noun in a sentence? For example, we have this is a boy. These are boys. This is a leaf. These are leaves. This is a baby. These are babies. This is a man. These are men. As you notice here, I emphasize letter T and the period at the end of a sentence. So when you create a sentence, always bear in mind that uh, use capital letter and uh, put a period. So let's have an activity time. I have prepared activities for you to answer. So here, the direction, write the plural form of the singular noun. You can post this for a while and answer it. Complete the chart. Write the singular or plural of each noun. Okay, so let's answer. Answer for the first activity, write the plural form of the singular noun we have. So one, toys, two, boxes, three, dishes, four, leaves, five, tomatoes, six, babies, seven, cities, eight, sheep, nine, men, ten, feet. Okay, so next, complete the chart. Write the singular or plural of each noun. Plant, wishes, grass, source. Light, hair, deer. Comment down below your score. It's shout out time. Thank you time. So first, I'm going to shout out Mom Jen from Dancesport Family. Hello po, thank you. Mom Aimee and Jonalyn from Bukawi Hills. Elementary, thank you din po sa inyong support. Ganun din po kina ka Larry, or Sir Larry, and ka Justina, Nanay Justina, dyan sa Bukawi din. Hello din po sa inyo. To my Casey family, we have Geneva and Kuya Patrick. Hello po. Ganun din po si Sam, Church Sam, and Ma'am Jen. Ma'am Jen. Si Mrs. Pinky na siya pong uh, nag-request sa akin na i-vlog ko din daw kung ano yung pagkakaiba ng um, yours and your. Even Mrs. Marshall, thank you din po. Kay ka kapatid na Jinis at sa kanyang asawa. Vlogger din po sila. Support din po natin. Sa aking pinsan, we have I, um, I mean, Kuyang Randy. Hello po, ingat po kayo dyan. And uh, So, Ma'am Reyna Lynn, ang pag-teacher ko po, maraming salamat po sa um, pag-support. Ganun din po sa kay Reyan Marie. Hello po. Uh, siya po ang uh, isa sa mga tag-edit ko minsan. Kung may mga practical errors, ganun din po si Rondo Papilos. Hello, blessing. Okay, so maraming salamat po. So please don't forget to subscribe my YouTube channel, John Langdeles. Ganun din po ang, ang FB page ko po, ang Janners Vlog. Pakifollow na din po ninyo. And don't forget to like and share na din po para sa mga um, bata na gusto pa pong matuto ng English. Okay? So yan lamang po. And maraming salamat. Paalam.